Yeah, we recently uh, launched Data Lifecycle Manager, which is a new service of Hortonworks. And Data Lifecycle Manager allows you to connect various Hadoop clusters spread around the globe or regions and gives you one interface to access all of your Hadoop clusters and actually manage the, the data across all of them. So for example, uh, if you have a cluster that's based in the States as well as a cluster based in South Africa, using Data Lifecycle Manager, you can connect the two, pair them up effectively, and you can uh, uh, design strategies for replicating data between the two clusters, whether this is for HDFS or, or, or for Hive. And Hive is really interesting. When we when we replicate Hive data, uh, you replicate both the the underlying data from HDFS as well as as well as Hive meta metadata, so that the structure of the data uh, and any ranger policies that you have. Uh, data Lifecycle Manager will will manage all of that for you end to end. Um, you can also do data uh, tiering. So if you have hot data on, on one cluster and you want to tear it off to a, perhaps a cheaper cluster somewhere else, Data Lifecycle Manager will allow you to do this by, by again, defining policies where you can say uh, data older than six months or 12 months automatically tear it for me off to my slower cluster. Without Data Lifecycle Manager, it's really easy to, to forget where you have your data. So it's easy if you have one or two Hadoop clusters, but what we see with a lot of our customers is that they have 20, 30, 40 Hadoop clusters spread around the globe. And it's really easy to forget, oh, where do I have my financial data or where do I have my uh, data science data? And uh, you can develop your scripts to copy them around and move them around yourself, whereas with Data Lifecycle Manager, it just give, again gives you this one overview and you can manage from one, one web page, pretty much, uh, where all your data is and how to move them around between the different clusters. So you don't have to remember. Data Lifecycle Manager will discover all of this data for you and present it on, on one screen. One of the trends that we see uh, over the last year or two is I IoT data. So whether that's data streaming from your cars or from your fridges back into, into regional clusters, we have a technology called Hortonworks Data Flow that allows you to connect your IoT devices out in the field hundreds or thousands of these devices, stream them into a, a regional or a central cluster, make real-time decisions on this data, um, compare, uh, filter, verify, apply a machine learning model, and we can actually communicate the result of that back to the device in the field to make a change. So if we detect that the fridge temperature is too low, too high, we can send that temperature via NiFi or Hortonworks data flow into a decision-making cluster and then send a, send a command back saying, hey, let's up that temperature or let's drop it, depending on what, what's been happening.